The ADR kit is carried on lorries, vans, or any vehicle which is carrying a hazardous load. There are different components to it. Some of the large items, these are carried outside the vehicle. So for example, on an articulated lorry, these would be carried maybe behind the cab. The sorts of things they need to carry are wheel chocks so they can stabilize the trailer if they maybe need to take the front end of the lorry away and leave the trailer in place. A broom, a shovel to actually clear up any mess, particularly when you've used granules from a spill kit. Fire extinguisher in case of any um, risk of fire. Also, there'd be a spill kit. Now, the spill kit would be uh, kept sometimes behind the, uh, in the cab or in a box on the back of the lorry. The spill kit itself would contain all the items necessary to try and contain a small spill. It won't do massive spills, but it will stop a small spill. There'd also be a PPE pack with all the personal protective equipment that they'd like to need. What needs to be in this is a torch, but also some spare batteries for the torch, so it's all always available to be used correctly. A full face mask, respirator, and a spare filter. This will keep any potential fumes and also chemicals away from the face. Chemical gloves to protect when you're picking up uh, any waste or handling any pipe work, and also a hard hat. Other items would be there are things like high-vis vests, but these are typically always carried by the driver anyway. Another part of the ADR kit is the paperwork. So the driver themselves would have to actually carry their driving license, but also the supporting licenses for their ADR qualification to prove that they are allowed to carry dangerous loads. There would also be some other paperwork and instructions. These would instructions in writing according to ADR. This would give all the key information, should there be an emergency, that could be handed over to the emergency services. So in written format, it makes it much easier to be able to give them to the emergency services, maybe if the driver's been injured. Remember, the ADR kit is law. You must carry an ADR kit if you're carrying any dangerous goods.